Oh, that was sh**. What's happening guys, it's Lewis TV, about another video, and today we have my Cardiff City match reaction. Ah, oh, what performance. 3-1 uh, loss, you know, to uh, our easiest game of the month. That's good. So, uh, if we get straight into it, uh, we started off with an early goal ruled out for Cardiff. Um, and basically, that showed things to come in the game. Uh, it was definitely offside and it was a correct decision. Team as a whole could not string a set of passes together. We kept them giving the ball away constantly and constantly. Every single player was doing it as well. It wasn't like a select individuals. Every single one was doing it. Keeper, the defence, the midfield, the attackers. All of them, well, the attackers, the attacker. Uh, all of them just giving the ball away constantly in that first half. And then the first goal, Josh Murphy absolutely tears up our right side of the defence. And I'm not actually sure where DaCosta was. Um, and then he plays it to Kiefer Moore, former Barnsley striker, I believe, who sits Ostergaard down on the floor and finesses it past Marco Morezzi to make it 1-0 to the hosts. Very poor goal to concede, but it was coming, to be honest, because we were shocking. Second goal, this one was just a ridiculous one. We had four players all on the edge of the six-yard box, three defenders and Marco Morezzi, and to be honest, I'm not really sure why we needed four there. Well, to be fair, three defenders, fair enough. But why is Marco Morosi stood there? Why can't he just leave the defenders to do what they need to do? And then they throw it, the they take the throw in. Morosi comes out, tries to punch it. He ends up punching it behind him, uh, which is good. And like, <laughs> it like it falls to Josh Murphy, who mi does miss the ball, but then it drops to Kiefer Moore, who side foots it into the net open goal finish to make it 2-0 to Cardiff his second goal of the game and he won't be complaining with the easiness of that chance and that was it for the first half nothing else really happened except we were still awful then the third goal about two minutes into the second half uh, Cardiff take a quick free kick and the ball finds Josh Murphy brother of former Coventry City winger Jacob Murphy. Uh, I don't even know what I'm going on about anymore. I'm waffling. Um, and yeah, he scores and basically seals the game. And yeah, that, that that's it. That's my match reaction. Uh, no, I'm joking. Don't worry. We've still got more to come. Um, our goal, I don't even know what happened, to be honest, because I was planning this video. I was writing down about their goals. Um, and then the ball just fell to Dominic Hyam, who scores. He puts it in the roof of the net and Cardiff Stamble is on. Uh but then nothing else actually did happen in the game. We other than the goal we showed no sign of a good scoring chance. Um that is the worst I've seen us play in a while. Even worse than our six two loss to Yeovil in my eyes. Um and we their keeper made about two saves, but they were both P rollers straight to him. Ostergaard did hit the bar once, which means we have now hit the bar eighteen times in the league this season. Eighteen. Um, I don't know why we started with one up top as well when we were doing so well with top, top especially Biamu and Yokares. I think that is how you say his name. Uh, but yeah, I don't know why we've just suddenly dropped to Yokares as well. I mean, he didn't do anything wrong, and him and uh, Biamu were working up for him. But, yeah, that's basically all I have to say. It was a shambolic performance. Our worst of the season by far. Our worst in a good couple of years. And, yeah, if you did enjoy the video, make sure you leave a like. Subscribe if you are new around here. And I'll see you all next time.